All Top 10 proudly presents How to Get Rich, 7 Brilliant Strategies for Increasing Wealth. Learning how to become wealthy has more to do with how you approach your goals than it does with your existing financial condition. By paying off debt, making a budget, investing, and increasing your income, you may increase your chances of becoming wealthy and reaching your financial goals. The average age of billionaires is actually 57, which shows that many successful people build their wealth over time via diligent habits and wise money management, especially if you don't come from a wealthy family. Please click the subscribe button if you're new here and let us know in the comments below saying I subscribed. I'll reply as many comments as I can. As we look more deeply at how to become wealthy, let's consider the behaviors that could position you for long-term financial security. How to get rich in 7 easy steps. Self-made millionaires don't become wealthy by accident. Instead, purposeful behavior is regularly used by people to make money and gain wealth. If you're prepared to take control of your finances, choosing and following a step-by-step -step plan will help you increase your wealth. Number 1. Define your goals. Before you start pursuing financial success, have a financial strategy. Think about the following questions as you develop your plan. What exactly does being wealthy entail? Do you have a desired net worth that I should strive to achieve? What does my monthly budget hope to achieve? Do I want to save money for investing or for paying off debt? Do you intend to retire early? Give specific answers so you can pinpoint your particular goals. After deciding on your overarching approach, break it down into more attainable short-term goals. After creating this strategy, you should have a clearer idea of where you're going and the path you need to take. Number 2. Stop paying interest on your debts. The biggest obstacle to your efforts is high interest loans. According to Experian, one of the three national credit agencies, the total amount of consumer loan balances increased by 5.4% between 2020 and 2021. High interest debt, like credit card debt, may be challenging to pay off. Along with the loan's principal, you typically also have to pay hefty interest charges. To begin controlling your debt, make a list of all of your obligations in ascending order of highest to lowest interest rate. Consider making extra principal payments on your high interest debts first to lower the overall amount of interest you might accrue once the debt is paid off. When using this option, find out from your lender if there is a certain process you must adhere to. You'll probably need to make it clear that the additional payment is for the principal balance of the loan. When you have paid off the first commitment in full, move on to the debt with the second highest interest rate. Focusing on high-rate debt allows you to avoid paying interest charges and have more money available for other costs. Number 3. Set up a budget and begin saving money. If you want to get out of debt and meet your financial goals, you must learn how to handle your money. Follow these steps to implement a core budgeting strategy. List your sources of income and outgoing expenses to determine expenditures. Next, determine how much you regularly make or spend on each item on your list. Keep an eye on the main categories of spending, analyze the monthly expenses you incur for things like groceries, utilities, and rent. Don't forget to factor in supplemental expenses for things like going out to eat or purchasing a new book. Locate areas for improvement. Find potential areas for savings once you have a clear view of your monthly cash flow. Maybe you could cook more regularly at home than you would eat out. Perhaps there are free activities in your area that you can take part in if you wish to spend less on entertainment. Use the money you save to invest, pay off debt, build a nest egg, establish an emergency fund, etc. Number 4. Self-reward initially. If you don't keep enough money on hand for emergencies, you run the risk of getting into problems financially if an unexpected need arises. If you don't have the money on hand, you might have to borrow it or put the cost on your credit card which can hurt your finances by increasing your debt. You'll be able to save more money if you pay yourself first. This requires setting aside a portion of your pay each month to transfer to a savings account in order to keep from using it elsewhere. Better yet, automate this process so that it is completed prior to the cash being available for use. You might set up an automatic transfer from your checking account to your savings account. If your employer uses direct deposit for your paychecks, 
you have the choice to divide the deposit so that one portion goes into a savings account and the other portion into your checking account. Number 5. Start your investments as soon as you can. Investing your money is typically one of the finest ways to accumulate wealth over time, provided that your investments are lucrative. If you keep all of your cash in a straightforward bank account, you run the risk of it losing value due to inflation. Investing is generally a wiser course of action while saving. Invest in equities, mutual funds, or exchange-traded funds to get into the market early and take advantage of compound returns ETFs. Start saving $1,000 each month by the age of 30. At a 7% rate of return, you would have more than $170,000 after 10 years, $500,000 after 20 years, and $1.15 million after 30 years. The earlier you invest, the longer a period of compound interest can be generated. There are two main types of accounts to choose from when investing in the stock market. You can use tax-advantaged retirement plans provided by your employer, such as an IRA or 401k. You can use one of the best brokerage accounts, such as Stash, Betterment, or Sophie. The renowned investor Warren Buffett suggests beginning with a diversified portfolio that includes ETFs that track important stock market indices, such the S&P 500. If your employer offers to match a portion of your 401k plan contributions, take advantage of the opportunity. The matching amount offers a quick 100% return on your investment, so it's worth maxing it out whenever you can. The stocks, bonds, and other investment vehicles you choose to employ are entirely up to you, although doing so can increase your level of risk and alter how you think about investing. Number 6. Boost your earnings. With your current salary, you can only save so much money. If you want to accelerate debt repayment and increase your investment contributions, find ways to increase your income. For examples, if you are content working at your current company, consider asking for a raise or aiming for a promotion. Find out how you may move closer to your professional goals by talking with your manager about them. If you are willing to look for a new career, think about enrolling in a course or earning a certification that could put you in the running for a position with a higher wage. Make sure to negotiate any job offer before accepting it. You should consider getting one of the best side jobs in addition to your primary source of income. Whether you choose to start a blog, drive for Uber, or freelance online, there are many creative ways to use your abilities and entrepreneurial spirit to make additional money. Number 7. Have the proper perspective. If you've previously struggled financially, you might not believe it's possible for you to achieve financial success. This limiting assumption makes every other level far more difficult to complete. It's essential to cultivate a wealth-building attitude if you want to learn how to become wealthy. It might take ongoing, intentional effort to succeed and amass more riches. This does not imply that there are no social inequities or that everyone is treated equally from the beginning. Certain groups have historically been denied the chance to amass wealth and leave it to their descendants, and some people face much more severe institutional obstacles than others. To get there, though, you might not take the necessary steps if you believe you will never be wealthy. By fostering an attitude of abundance and letting rid of constricting beliefs, you can boost your financial status. Duration of time to get wealthy. Being wealthy might mean different things to different people. Some people may feel wealthy if their net worth is a million dollars or higher. Some people might want to become financially independent so they can retire sooner. The length of time it takes to become affluent depends on how you define rich. Given that the median age of millionaires is 57, the bulk of affluent individuals likely attain a net worth of $1 million or more near to retirement age. Without a doubt, many millionaires become wealthy via years of investing and saving rather than through winning the lottery. Many retirement gurus advise saving enough money to replace 70% to 80% of your pre-retirement income. In light of this, if your yearly income is $100,000, you will require $70,000 to $80,000 each year for retirement. Using a retirement savings calculator, you may determine how much money you'll need for retirement and when you can attain this objective. Even while it can take several years to become wealthy with this technique, it can set you up for long-term financial security. What salary will make you wealthy? 
rich is an elusive idea. Even while making $100,000 a year may make one feel fortunate, Kim Kardashian or Elon Musk would suffer a severe drop in popularity if they did it. A salary of at least $135,000 is required to meet the definition of wealth, which is two times the $67,500 median national family income for 2020. If you're trying to figure out what salary would make you wealthy, it's critical to consider your particular circumstances and goals. Will you be wealthy in 10 years? You might be able to become wealthy in 10 years through a combination of saving money, increasing your income, creating various revenue streams, investing, and just simple luck. You can also learn how to start a business to have more control over your money. Avoid schemes to make quick money. The majority of investors lose everything they invest in these frauds, which are typically extremely risky, even though a small number of investors may earn handsomely from them. How old was Elon Musk when he became a millionaire? Elon Musk, a 27-year-old entrepreneur, achieved self-made millionaire status in 1999 when he sold a web software company for more than $300 million. He became a billionaire at the age of 41. Musk asserts that he owed $100,000 in college loans when he started his first firm. The first step in learning how to become wealthy is to set short-term goals that gradually advance you toward your long-term objectives. Consider how increasing your income sources, setting aside money, paying off high-interest debt, and making future investments could all contribute to your financial success. Even though it might take some time and work to become wealthy, putting these strategies into practice could help you take charge of your own finances and gradually build up your wealth. Find out which investment apps are the finest so you can start investing and learn how to make money. This is the topic for today. Thank you for watching. I hope you have a great day and we'll see you all in next video.